Hey everybody, I'm Holly, and today I'm going to share with you guys some of our favorite healthy cold cereals. So for us, a couple days a week, um, life gets crazy busy. And twice a week, um, we all kind of get home around the same time, and it, it's dinner time. And so we were kind of getting in this bad habit of going out to eat. And wasn't always the healthiest, which I know, I know, I, I, I know better, but it wasn't always the healthiest and it definitely wasn't getting cheap. So, you know, my husband and I were talking, I'm like, we need to, we need to come up with a better solution because we, one, I want us to eat healthier and two, um, this is just getting expensive. And so my husband's like, well, why don't we have, um, cold cereal for dinner? It's like, are you sure? Like, can we do that? <laughs> like, is that okay? And, um, so after thinking about it, I'm like, you know, even if I bought those really expensive, healthy cold cereals that you find at the health food store that you never buy because they're like eight bucks a box, even if we got one of those, that's still cheaper. If we, even if, I, I don't think we'd eat the whole box in one sitting as a family, but even if we did, let's just say we did, that's still cheaper than going out to eat. And it's a lot healthier than what we were going out to eat, eating, you know? So for us and our family, we just kind of plan on just having those cold, uh, cold cereal two nights a week rather than going out to eat. And so I just wanted to share with you guys um, some of our favorite cold cereals that we have right now that we're enjoying and why, um, why I buy them versus other cereals. The first cereal that I want to show you, it's a granola. And it's by Purely Elizabeth. And I gotta tell you guys, this is delicious. This is good. Uh, the thing about granola cereals is even those that are marketed as healthy, they still have lots of sugar. Um, they use a lot of like refined sugars, um, even maybe organic cane, uh, cane juice, which is still sugar. Um, but uh, this, this one, let me read the ingredients to you guys. So organic gluten-free oats, organic coconut palm sugar. I love that they used coconut palm sugar instead of a refined sugar. Um, organic raw virgin coconut oil, which again is amazing. You guys know me. I love my coconut oil versus like some cheap vegetable oil that a lot of granolas use. Organic puffed amaranth, organic quinoa flakes, organic millet flakes, organic sunflower seeds, organic chia seeds, organic cinnamon, and sea salt. That is it. And these are so good. And I got um, this at Whole Foods, I want to say for like five something, $5.99. Which again, you know, I, I get it, it's still expensive, but um, even if my family ate all of this in one day, one sitting for one night, it's still cheaper than going out to eat. And those ingredients, so much better for us than, uh, you know, fast food options that are out there. So, highly recommend this cereal. And this is the original. Um, they do have some other flavors, but I think that some of them might have sugars added. Um, so this is the one that I get. The next cereal is Power O's. I, uh... First had this, tried this when I was at my sister's house a couple years ago. And it's made with bean powder. Like the first, yeah, so the first ingredient, let me read this. So the first ingredient is bean blend of navy beans, lentils and garbanzo beans, brown rice, salt, and vitamin E added to maintain freshness. So no sweeteners at all. I mean, you can definitely taste the beans, um, but it's not bad. It's kind of more subtle. Um, I personally prefer, if I'm having this as a cereal, to add like some raw honey on top and and uh, eat it that way. But I've, I've also given put these like in a little baggie and given it to my daughter and we've had like a quick snack or a breakfast on the go and she eats them plain, you know, with nothing else added. So, of course, she doesn't really know any difference, so she enjoys them. And, uh, yeah, this is just a good option. And, of course, you can sweeten it how you want to. But, yeah, a lot healthier than... Uh, Honey Nut Cheerios that are out there, that's for sure. Uh, next cereal. I like these uh, puffed, this is puffed millet. The only ingredient is puffed 
millet, puffed whole grain millet, and uh, also same brand, Arrowhead Mills, puffed barley. Puffed barley, and these are great. So these are actually pretty, uh, pretty inexpensive. They're like a dollar sixty-nine. I mean, depending on the store, depending on if they have a sale going on, I've seen these for like a dollar fifty um, to about two dollars a bag. And there's a lot more, uh, diff you know, different grains. You can have puffed corn. You can have puffed brown rice. Um, there's organic options as well, but they're pr pretty cheap for you know a dollar fifty-three uh, to two dollars for a bag and uh we like to sweeten it with like i said either raw honey or um fresh fruit you know fresh berries and it's just you know it's just so much easier healthier than um a lot of the other puff cereals that you'll see um in the grocery store so onto our favorite cereal the brown rice cacao crisps um so it's basically a puffed brown rice with, uh, as my daughter calls it, chocolate. <laughs> and uh, it's really good. And I love how healthy it is as well. So it's made with organic sprouted brown rice. Sprouted is also uh, just amazing because it just increases the nutritional quality um, of the rice. Organic coconut palm sugar, so it's unrefined sugar. Organic cacao, which is less processed than cocoa, right? Organic sunflower oil, sunflower less thin, unrefined salt. And the unrefined salt that they use is um, the Redmond Real Salt that I love. And then also vitamin E. So this stuff is good. Very delicious. And the cheapest place that I've been able to find this, believe it or not, is actually Whole Foods. I'll get this for um, like $5.99. And this week it was actually 20% off, so I stocked up. Um, instead, I've, I've seen it at other places for like $7.99 a box. So still, we don't eat all of this in one sitting at, at one time. And uh, still a lot cheaper than going out to eat and a lot healthier too. So there you go. This brand is good. I like this. So that leads us to the last box. Ancient... I don't know if I'm saying this right, maize, my, it, I don't know, sorry I'm butchering that, but basically they're cornflakes, um, so they're organic sprouted, maize, maize, <laughs> I don't know, how, I don't know how to say it, but it, it, it means corn, right, organic coconut palm sugar, organic sprouted buckwheat, organic sprouted amaranth, unrefined salt, and vitamin E. So again, it's using all of those sprouted grains, which increases the nutritional property. And it's using unrefined uh, salt or, well, yeah, unrefined salt, but then also unrefined sugar. They're using that coconut palm sugar, which is good. So just a good quality cereal. I mean, if you look at this and compare it to cornflakes that you'd find in the store, huge difference. Uh, these you can eat on your own on, on their own, but I like to personally I like to add a little bit of raw honey to it and uh, Enjoy it that way, but these are good. So there you have it guys. Those are um, our favorite healthy cold cereals that we're enjoying right now um, again, it's uh, a lot healthier than fast food and it's also a lot cheaper and it just kind of it's something that works for us and uh, Hopefully you found this video helpful and I will see you guys on the next video. Bye